Hi guys. Um, so, my day started off about 25 past 6 this morning and after doing a morning workout of 100 press ups, 100 leg raises, 30 pull ups, 30 chin ups after the night walk. So I walked to the swimming pool. So it's 2.44 miles. So it was about a mile there and a mile back. I went for a swim. I swam nearly a mile. I only had another 16 lengths to do and it would have been a mile but I didn't realize so I only I stopped at about 55 and then I walked back I then went and had some coffee and some lunch I did about two and a half three hours of volunteering came back I had a nap and then I went on a run in the rain it's 6.9 miles with quite a heavy elevation um, and then I did another 100 push-ups, no, I did 50 press-ups, 50 leg raises, 15 chin-ups, 15 pull-ups, I then went out and had a salad and a soft drink, um, I came back and I had uh, another 100 push ups, 100 leg raises, 30 chin ups, 30 pull ups, and then I went out for a walk just now and I've just done six miles in an hour and a half. So I've done all of this. So I've done my morning workout at home. I then got on the bus, got off the bus, walked over a mile to the swimming pool, swam nearly a mile not far off a mile and walked a mile and a half back to the bus stop came home had some lunch did uh, about two or three hours work volunteering for charity I had a nap after that then I went on a run and then I did some more workout at home another 50 push-ups 50 leg raises went out for some evening lunch or evening meal salad cheap came back did another hundred push-ups press-ups same thing hundred leg raises and 30 chin-ups 30 pull-ups and I've just been out for a evening walk of six over six miles and I'm gonna do another 50 push-ups and 50 press ups, same thing. Uh, 50 leg raises, 10 pull ups, and 10 chin ups. And then I'm going to get some sleep. And this is all in um, this is all in a less than 24 hour time period. So this is from half six this morning, and it's about 10 to midnight now. So um, I actually had quite a bad fall the other day. And I damaged um, my muscle and I've just trained and exercised through the injury which I don't recommend but you can do it you can actually exercise beyond and through any injury you have and people were telling me that I'd plateaued in my fitness uh, but I've never done this before this level of amount in one day so I can't have plateaued because I've never done this much before so if you look on I've got two devices now uh, Fitbit has been collecting my data all day let me just refresh that uh, so I've done 49,000 steps 44,000 between 44,000 is the lowest reading and 49,000 is the highest reading and this is today 
the best I've ever done in one day is 55,000. Uh, walk, run, walk. And then Garmin has also been collecting my data. So today, I've done a run, I've done a swim, I've done a, another run. 33,000 steps according to this one, which is quite a big difference. Uh, but some of the time I haven't been wearing this, but I've been wearing this most of the day. Uh, anyway, yeah, so it's totally achievable, even if you are recovering from an injury, and even if people have told you or you have persuaded yourself that you've got to a fitness level that you can't exceed, which would be plateauing. What else have I done today? Uh, yeah, I've done I've done shopping. Um, I've done other bits and bobs that I needed to do. I've achieved quite a lot today, so I'm I'm pretty proud of myself. Um, yeah. So all I need now is a bike, and then I can start cycling, and then I can possibly look at getting into triathlon or Ironman. Um, but yeah, just thought I'd share that with you and a bit of an update. So it's totally achievable. I am pretty tired, but I haven't hurt myself and I haven't I haven't pushed myself beyond um, any kind of safety level. And I've done all of that today. And I've still, like I said, if I'd known that I was only 16 lengths off doing a mile, I could have done. I could have easily squeezed out that 16 more lengths. And I'm going to do a few more push-ups and pull-ups today, and I feel pretty fine and healthy. So, yeah, I think um, I could have probably ran a little bit more as well, but it was horrible weather. So, yeah, you can push yourself to expectations that you didn't even have or thought you had, and you can achieve stuff that you didn't think you could possibly achieve. Um, and there's there's people that are 10 years younger than me, I'm not sure would think that they could achieve what I've achieved today. Um, but yeah, it's totally possible. Anyway, I'm starting to waffle now. So I'll see you next time.